Hi, CJ here, and I'm reading right now in the Gospel of Luke, and today I was in Luke 21. And this is the scene in which Jesus is talking to his disciples on the Mount of Olives about what's going to happen leading up to the sign of his soon return. And as I'm listening to Jesus in this moment, um, it's also recorded in Matthew 24 and 25, um, I'm hearing a contrast between Jesus and his orientation to his soon return and the events that will lead up to that. And what I often hear in a lot of Christian circles about the last day events and end time prophecy. And the biggest difference is when Jesus speaks to his followers, he induces faith and trust. And what I often hear is fear and anxiety. And what Jesus is doing is he seems to be coming with this orientation that's a balance between an honest awareness of the reality of life on this planet leading up to a soon return and a rested, assured, patient, and enduring trust in him who's telling us what's going to happen. And so when it comes to the last days, I believe Jesus wants you to be, as a follower of Jesus, someone who is trusting and enduring through your faith in him and the gospel, as opposed to people that the that Jesus describes are going to be uh, people with their hearts failing them for fear of the things that are coming upon the earth. And when I look at what's happening right now in our world today, there's a lot of reason for us to be, to be anxious. But when you have a faith in Jesus, there's a lot of reason to be hopeful, to have hope, to have trust, to have a positive outlook because Jesus already knew this was coming and he has us safely in his hands.